You say you'll be down in five The smell of your perfume Is floating down the stairs You're fixing up your hair like you do I know that I'll be a mess The second that I see you You won't be surprised It happens every time It's nothing new It's always on a night like tonight I thank God you can read my mind Cause when you look at me with those eyes I'm speechless Staring at you, standing there in that dress What it's doing to me ain't a secret Cause watching you is all that I can do And I'm speechless You already know that you're my weakness After all this time I'm just as nervous Every time you walk into the room I'm speechless It started when you said hello Did something to me And I've been in a daze Ever since the day that we met You took the breath out of my lungs Can't even fight it And all of the words out of my mouth Without even trying And I'm speechless Staring at you standing there in that dress What it's doing to me ain't a secret Cause watching you is all that I can do And I'm speechless You already know that you're my weakness After all this time I'm just as nervous Every time you walk into the room Watching you is all that I can do oh, 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 I'm speechless You already know that you're my weakness After all this time I'm just as nervous Every time you walk into the room I'm speechless Oh, you know it, baby Good afternoon, everybody. What a joyous occasion the Lord has blessed us all to witness today. Man and Maya have just officially become Mr. and Mrs. K.L. For the first time ever, I would like to introduce Mr. and Mrs. I'm a bit heartbroken though because as many of you know I was supposed to be there today to be the best man but due to complications from COVID-19 I was unable to travel and be a part of this blessed event. Nonetheless my heart overflows with unending pride and joy as my nephew who I love like my very own son has received his blessing from Almighty God in the form of his new bride Mike. As the Bible tells us in Proverbs 18 and 22 he who finds a wife finds a good thing and it obtains favor from the Lord. I see the love you both share when you interact with one another, and I know it's real. Such love is rare and should be protected and cherished forever and always. I myself, having 25 years in the marriage game, would like to share a few things with you that can help keep the marital waters pretty calm. First, keep God first in your marriage. He is the key to all things. Make your spouse your best friend. Whatever it was that 
you did to make one another fall in love, double that energy into keeping one another in love. Keep your personal business personal. Problems inside any marriage cannot be solved outside the marriage. Never, ever, ever, and I mean ever, have too much pride to say, I was wrong, I'm sorry. And if you're right, keep God told you so to yourself. Never go to bed angry at one another, even if you have to disagree. Even if you have to agree to disagree, excuse me. And this last one is probably the most important one of all, and I want you both to listen very carefully. Maya, when your husband asks you where you want to eat at, please pick somewhere. Anyway, I love you both with all my heart, and as God sees fit to grant me any reasonable portion of physical and mental health, I will always be there for you if you need me. So if you all will, raise your glasses and join me in toasting the newlyweds. To Kayapa and Maya, may you live as long as you want, but never want as long as you live. Salute. Love you guys.